YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. I'm a mom of two little boys and we do a whole bunch of different content here on my YouTube. Today I am going to do a belt video. It's something that somebody requested for like a mid-sized body what to do with belts. So I might cut this into two videos because I have quite a few outfits. Um, I ordered a whole bunch of stuff for this. Some of it worked, some of it didn't. But I just want to show you some of them are dressy, some of them are casual, different things that you can do with a belt. Um, I don't really wear belts to be honest with you, um, but it was definitely fun kind of pairing things together and doing this video and finding what works and what doesn't. So yeah, I enjoyed the video, but I'm just gonna show you guys the stuff in my big mirror in my room like I normally do and show you kind of the little outfits that I uh, paired together and let me see what you think. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna go through these like super quick. The first outfit we have is a black dress that I got off of Amazon. I really like this dress. Um, however, I don't like the arms. I have, um, bigger broader shoulders um I'm small smaller in my bottom half than I am in my top half and it makes me very uncomfortable to have my arms out when I lost a lot of weight and was a lot smaller my arms were a lot smaller and I was much more comfortable in my own body um now uh I just I don't like to have my arms out I don't like to wear tank tops this dress is really really flattering on my body um this belt cinches my waistline here and overall like when I look at it I'm like it's super cute but all I see in my personal <laughs> eyes are my arms and so if this went down to my elbows or even if it was long sleeve I would like it a lot I more. typically choose long sleeve dresses um, and I will show you a long sleeve dress uh, when I choose dresses because I don't like to showcase my um, my thicker arms and that's just a personal preference thing um, it is what it is so uh, yeah this is the first one dresses are a super cute way this one you could you could tie, do a tie up on the um, side of it. I think I would probably just pair this with sandals. I do have some shoes with the other outfits, but I think this is just would be cute just like barefoot or with some like really, really simple sandals. I don't own a lot of sandals because I don't wear a lot of dresses or shorts. Um, but if I had a pair, I would show you what it looked like with them on. But yeah, this is super cute. This is like a seven out of 10 for me just because of the arms. If the arms went down, even to my elbows, I would like it a lot more. So I will unfortunately be returning this dress. Okay, so as far as the dress itself goes, ignore how wrinkly this is. I need to steam it. Um, this is much more up my alley. It covers my arms, it's flowy, it's got the um, arms, the wrists, I mean, that I love with tighten and then kind of puff out because it just hides all of that that I don't like to show. Um, this I got off of like Shein or something. It's amazing i love it it did come with a red belt but i think i actually prefer it with the um the belt that i put on here i think it showcases a little bit more and it actually kind of looks more like what would i call medieval looking which i am like totally there for um it just reminds me of that kind of era uh, i really like it it's got a pretty uh high slit that goes up so you will got to be a little careful wear something under there that doesn't do any peekaboos um yeah i think it's really cute and this belt i have a black belt in a couple different ones but i think this brown this kind of chocolate brown looked the best with this red color but overall oh my gosh this is cute and i don't know what kind of shoe i would wear with this so i have these booties that i thought would look kind of cute <laughs> are not so i would not wear these booties with it i would probably just wear some sandals or um something else i would figure it out but um taller boots sandals lace up sandals would be really cute i don't really love the look i feel like it kind of takes it from uh <laughs> being like higher up the food chain in the castle to like working in the kitchen <laughs> um more like that kind of or like a barmaid or something uh these shoes are not it also my legs are so wide ignore that but it is what it is I really really like the uh dress itself I really like the belted area I don't care for these particular shoes moving on Okay, so this is the next one. I would never wear this. Um, this is very out of my comfort zone also. 
Do I think it's cute? Absolutely. Um, do I think it would be cuter on somebody else? Absolutely. Um, I think the idea is there. Um, again, this is very tight on my arms. I'm also sweating. Um, it's very hot. I got this like bodysuit off of Amazon. It doesn't fit me this way, uh, so it's just tucked in. The skirt came off of Amazon. It does not have pockets. It's kind of thin. Um, it's kind of just like a whatever this material is. Slippery material. Um, I don't know. Like I said, the idea is there. I do think in some ways it's okay. Um, I just don't feel good in this outfit. I think it just, um, from the front, I think it's pretty flattering, but from the side, I just feel very uncomfortable and I just would not wear, um, maybe the skirt and the belts I do like, but I would not wear this top. So I think what I'll do is I'm gonna chuck this off and I'm gonna replace it with just a t-shirt and then tuck the t-shirt in and let's see uh, what it looks like that way. Okay, so I swapped the bodysuit out with a t-shirt. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, this is all kind of falling apart. This is supposed to be kind of yay here. This is supposed to be kind of like French tucked in here with the belt. You could, I suppose, tuck the whole thing in. Let's see. But then you're kind of in the same boat as the other one, but this is looser. Okay, so assuming I did a much better tucking job than that, um, <laughs> I feel like it makes me look goofy. I don't know. Um, it's, it's one of those things where you can picture it in your head and you're like, okay, this is going to be really cute. And then you do it and you're like, mm, no. In some ways I look at this and I'm like, oh yeah, it's cute. I have it all bunched in the back because the shirt's too big. Uh, and then I'm just like, no. Um, I always see people with like these long skirts and a belt or no belt um, and like tennis shoes and like a big oversized shirt tucked in. And it looks so cute. But on me, I just for my body um, and my frame, I just don't like these proportions. Um, I just don't like this look really at all, at all. Okay, um, this one, I would wear this. I would wear this out. Uh, I think it's kind of cute. Um, gosh, you could almost do boot cut. Maybe at the end I'll throw a pair of like boot cut jeans on and do the same this part. I love these booties with this. I put the chocolate brown belt back on with the same shirt I had on last time. These, I shrunk these in the dryer and they're like a little bit snug, but these are just my American Eagle stretchy blue jeans and I absolutely love this outfit. Uh, my arms are covered. I feel better about my bottom half. Uh, the booties I think are really, really cute and I just think that this outfit covers my arms. It's um, much better of an option and I think it's really cute and I would wear this uh, in a heartbeat. So I think I'm going to keep this belt. I wasn't going to keep some of them, but I actually like it uh, quite a bit. You know what? I'm going to throw on the Fabletics. Uh, I don't think that video is out yet t-shirt I got. It's also a crop top. It's more crop than this so I can see what it looks like with something that doesn't have quite as much fabric on it. Okay so here is this one. I hmm hmm I don't know if I like this one as much. It's it's a lot more cropped. I guess you probably can't tell but the other one was like three inches longer. Um, I think if this was like a little snugger and just not so loose so it sat a little bit better. No I don't know if I like that either. Um yeah, I don't know. The French tuck is just because it's like a weird length. It kind of sticks out right at the top. And it's like not, there's not really enough to tuck because it's not quite long enough. Um, and then if I let it out, it's like, this is that one. If you watch my Fabletics haul, I'll explain what I, how I feel about it. But I don't really care for this. Uh, but I do want to see what this looks like with tall boots. So let me throw on a pair of tall boots. Okay. Um, I think I prefer the short boots. Uh, I, I mean, it's fine. I don't think it's like horrible or anything. I wonder if this would look better with a sweater. So this combo, I don't like. I don't like this shirt. I don't like these boots, um, all of this together. I like the other combo with the short boots and the other brown shirt. Um, I just don't like this, but I'm wondering if this would look better with a sweater. Um, yeah, I just don't like 
this at all. I don't think it's super flattering. I think it looks like okay from the front, but this shirt is just like a weird length. So it's not, not really the best for what I would like here. Okay, so I got this one off of Amazon. Uh, it's not the best quality. There's like some wannabe real lace on here. It's very scratchy. Um, I forgot, I didn't do an Amazon haul for all this stuff because then you would have just seen it on me and also again on me so it didn't make sense so i got this off of amazon i do like this better i like this better with the tall boots um i still think this would look really cute with the short boots and this is a really cute top uh, i just wish it wasn't so scratchy and uncomfortable i would keep it um if it was not so uncomfortable to wear uh it is just very like it fits fine but it's just like the arms are just not comfortable they are just not comfortable at all i think if it was better done it would be really cute i think the shirt itself is adorable and i would wear this whole outfit um for sure if the shirt quality was just better so i might try to find one of these like um what's this fabric called R like raglan is that what they call it i don't know what it's called with the lace and the buttons and from like a boutique and find one that's an actual better quality because i do think that this is super super cute and i would wear this so um yeah this is like a nine and a half out of ten um i really really like it a lot and i wish that the shirt was not so cheap but that's what you get from Amazon. Sometimes I get great stuff. Sometimes I get stuff that's not so great. So, okay. I promise I'll try a different um, belt. I have like four, but a lot of the shirts I've been trying on are like the same color as the belts that are the other ones. So it's like too matchy matchy. I really like this color of this chocolate brown. It kind of just like goes with everything. This sweater is like a tad bit puffy. So I think if it was like just a little bit lighter um, and not quite so thick, this would be really cute and I would I would wear this in a heartbeat. Um, I think it's cute with the short boots. I think it would be okay with the tall boots, but those are the same color as the shirt, so I wouldn't do that. But I do have some chocolate brown ones. Um, and yeah, so I think the uh, idea of this is cute. So blue jeans, boots, tall or short, with a belt and then a, like a puffy sweater um, is really, really cute. And I like it a lot. I have a lot of brown here because I love fall colors, but I will put on, <laughs> I will put on a different one, I promise. So I have a couple other t-shirts, not t-shirts, like tops I'm gonna try on really quick. And then I'm gonna try a gray one um, and see. This is pretty casual. This is really cute for like fall. I just think it needs to have, this is like a really thick, this is from one of my Black Friday hauls. It's just a really, like thick top and I feel like it's just so much that it bunches and kind of sits weird but if there was a little less fabric I think that it would be perfectly fine so yeah you can see it kind of it's just like a little bit too much so but I, I think overall this is decent okay so again <laughs> I was gonna change the belt but this brown one looks so good uh so I'll throw another belt on so we can see a different one but um I got this shirt off Amazon it is way too big however I was gonna return it because I didn't like it. Um, I actually don't hate it. I really don't. It's kind of like a three quarter sleeve. Um, it covers my, it's kind of a tighter like neck on here, but I don't like hate it. Um, and I think it's really actually pretty cute now that I have it kind of styled and you could actually even probably throw on a necklace with this. Um, and that would be cute too. So let me put a brown, um, or different colored belt on so we can see what one of the other ones looks like. Okay. So I'm not going to lie. This belt's really cute too. This is a set of three that came off of Amazon. This is the one I have on this lighter kind of cognac color and then uh this black one they came in a set of three they were really expensive the other belts i have is this one which came from uh target i believe it's in a size large that's the like chocolate brown one that i'm going to keep it's just really like goes with everything and then this one is <laughs> i didn't realize it had that on there and it's so funky and i don't like hate it but i don't love it you don't see this part on the front because it's the same color on the front. It's only when it's turned around on the back that you see it. But yeah, I'm, I, I can't return it. The window's too late to return and that's a little bit out of my comfort zone. Um, too much just to, uh, I tried it on, I don't, I don't love it. It's fine from the front, but from the back it's pretty funky. So uh, yeah, this is cute. I like this belt too. Um, I don't like this belt as much as the other one. I was gonna keep the set, but 
I, now that I look at it, I, I don't like this quite as much as the other one, but I do like it. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's okay. <sighs> we'll see. I have a black and gray set. So let's try that on and see what a different color scheme looks like because this is like a whole lot of um, browns that I've been doing just because I happen to have a lot of those kind of fall colors because those are colors that I really, really like to wear. Um, and that's just what I wear all the time so that's why I have so many so um pumpkin orange or burnt orange and mustard yellow I love those colors so very much uh, I probably need to try to branch out and get stuff in other colors but I'm just a neutral kind of girl so I don't mind a little bit of color but uh I don't go like crazy or ham or anything these would be cute also if you rolled um like cuffed the bottom of these jeans with a little cuff kind of sitting in there would be cute too I think also okay so this hat looks kind of weird because I have a ponytail, like a half pony up. And so I have like no hair out here and it makes me look like my forehead is huge. Uh, this, um, hmm, I don't know. One thing I don't like is that this black belt has like rose gold hardware. I thought it was going to have silver hardware, wear, um, but it doesn't. It's like rose gold. So I wish it was silver, uh, but I, I still think that it's cute. Um, I just wish it was silver. <laughs> so I, this is a lot of black. I feel like this needs to have maybe gray boots, which I have tall gray boots or, okay, so that's a no. <laughs> I thought maybe if I wore like some kind of dressed up tennis shoe, it might work, but the, no, maybe with a t-shirt. Um, the belt is, I think, okay. The hat is too much. Um, the hat is definitely too much for the hat situation these shoes i don't think work with this top i think if it was more casual and i had a i don't have a gray t-shirt but if i had like a gray t-shirt and tucked it in i do think that it would actually be um okay i i do and i do think actually those booties i think would be good too okay so i wanted to try it with a boot cut jean um i used to love these jeans but uh they're for some reason like a little bit big now in my area and so there's like a bunch of extra fabric that didn't used to be there i need um i need one size down so uh the belt i have cinched pretty snugly i don't think i like this i think it's not super flattering with the bootcut jeans i feel like if this was more of a lower rise um with the belt it might look better uh this is just not it i just don't like this at all i feel like it looks like i'm going to like a rodeo but like if i needed like a big belt buckle you know like a like an actual like chunky rodeo belt buckle um i've <laughs> i used to show horses so i have worn something similar to this but more of a t-shirt boots boot cut jeans and a big ass belt buckle. Um, that is a flashback to my, uh, childhood. In theory, this is cute. Um, I don't know. I almost think like, I just feel like if I threw a, uh, like Buffalo plaid, you know, button up and like a belt buckle on, I just would look like I'm going to the rodeo. And I mean, that's cool. I like that vibe but I'm not going to a rodeo, so I don't wanna look like I'm going to a rodeo if I don't ever have plans to go to the rodeo. Um, yeah, it's just not it. Uh, the idea is cute. I really do like a boot cut jean with these boots. I think that itself is cute. I'm gonna see if I can find these jeans in a size smaller, or maybe I'll try to find them in a lower rise. I just, these are higher rise. And if you've watched any of my videos, I actually don't prefer high rise. I prefer mid rise. Um, I just, it's just too much for me. There's just too much of this area going on and it's just not my favorite. So, I mean, it's cute in theory. The idea is there, just the execution of the look of this is just not, not it. Okay, uh, I think I got fatter or something because these jeans are tight. Uh, they are not too tight that I can't breathe, but they're from like, uh, I don't remember what they're from. I think they were from when, before I got pregnant, but they were too big then. So 
I kept them because I was like, oh, just keep them because they were just a little bit too big. And now they're like a little bit too small. <laughs> so they're really cute. They're from uh, like some, everything I showed you is Judy Blue Jeans or American Eagle. That's what I always buy. These are from something called Society Something. Um, they're so comfortable. They just need to be like literally a size bigger or a half a size bigger. Um, they fit fine. They're not like, my fat's not doing out or anything, but they're just a little bit more snug than I would like. This is kind of fun. Um, I don't know. Is it like super ugly or is it, is it okay? Does it need to be a t-shirt instead of like a blouse? Hmm. I don't know if I hate it or I like it. Uh, I don't wear a lot of black jeans. These are, the, I think, the only black jeans I own, to be honest. They're okay. Um, I like them. I wonder if I lose a little bit more weight. I'm back on keto, so um, yeah, I don't know. I feel like maybe if it was just a belt, you know, like a like a black belt, not with this chunky thing. Just no, maybe not. I don't know if you guys can tell, but this shininess is not my natural glow. Um, it's sweat. It is sweat because it's hot in here and I've been trying all these clothes and I'm literally like getting greasy and sweaty from just clothes on and off and on and off. So now I have to just clean up everything because it's gonna give me so much anxiety with all this stuff. So I'm gonna make a pile, um, I'm not gonna film it. I'm gonna make a pile of the stuff that I'm gonna return. I'm gonna put everything I tried on that is my regular stuff back in the closet, actually hang it up and clean up the mess in my room because it's just a crap show in here and put my mirror back and stuff. Uh, overall, I thought that was really fun. That was definitely not something that I would normally do. I did buy a pair of like black slacks. Um, they don't fit, so they're too small. Um, I thought they would have a little bit of stretch to them because I did want to try a couple pairs of, uh, or a couple outfits with some like like work slacks, but they, they don't fit, so I couldn't do that. And I did have a pair of like flared leggings <laughs> that are like thicker, kind of like almost look dressy, they're shiny. Uh, but I was like, they don't have belt holes and it was gonna look like really weird. So I just x made that. So instead of doing like, a dressy video and a dress down video of belt looks um, and ideas. I just kind of crammed it all into one because I've had all this stuff that's been coming in slowly for so long I need to return some of it. The stuff I'm not keeping or the time slot for Amazon is going to run out. Uh, so I'm going to load all that stuff up into my truck today. I have some stuff from Christmas I got to return. It's going to be a huge return. Overall, I thought that was really fun. Um, that is definitely not something that I would normally think to even try. I really liked the jeans with the brown t-shirt with the, like little faces on it. I liked that outfit. Um, Everything else was okay. I like the idea. Oh, I liked the leopardy looking top too. I think I'm actually going to keep it with the three quarter sleeve length. I like the look of the dresses with the belts. I do think it's cute, especially if you have a, a dress that doesn't have a lot of shape. It definitely helps to kind of cinch in the middle and define that waist and kind of give you that hourglass shape, which um, it is flattering on most body types. So I thought that that was cute. And then it's hard with the length on some of these. I feel like some of them, they needed to be a little longer or a little shorter. You almost have to find a shirt that's gonna look just right, um, especially when you have a little bit of flub or rollage that you can't just, like you, everything's not straight, so you can't just have it like hanging out wherever and it just like falls perfectly. Um, when you have curves, you have to kind of, placement is kind of important, so uh, yeah. Overall, that was really fun. I really enjoyed it. I'm really not looking forward to picking up the mess that I just made in my um, bedroom because it's like an explosion of clothing and crap everywhere. I hope you guys enjoyed. It's not, some of the outfits didn't work. Uh, some of them I didn't like at all. Some of them I did. And and I'm not, you know, a professional fashion guru. I just, um, I had a request for the video and I thought that it would be fun to just try some stuff. So I would have liked to find a couple other things that were more dressy, but I tried to cover, you know, different jeans, uh, some dresses and different kind of ideas. Um, there was a very big variety of colors because most of it was the same kind of like cognac, um, pumpkin-y color because that's just what I own a lot of. But um, overall, it just gives somebody an idea of different things. Um, I think overall, I think the belt look with the tuck, the French tuck, I, I prefer the shorter boots 
than the the taller boots i just think that that kind of ratio looks better on my body personally um and so yeah but anyways uh i'm going to go ahead and go clean up this mess and uh yeah so next couple videos i think are my fabletics hauls videos and uh those are interesting so stay tuned for that and we will see you guys next time